In this video, I want to show you how to synchronize a strategy based on a trading system that has a position if you have no real world position. So I'm looking at Night Trader E Mini SP. It's in playback mode in Ninja Trader 8, and you see there is no position currently. And I've paused the market replay. You can't do this in real time as far as pausing the market, but for demonstration purposes on how to submit a strategy so that it synchronizes with your account, I'm going to show you how to do that. Do the start behavior in Ninja Trader 8. So, for example, I'm running this in sim mode. If you're running this in sim mode and you see Night Trader take a signal and you say, All right, I want to get in on that trade. I'm watching all my systems in sim mode and I'm not in any position right now and I want to. I want to get into this trade. The trade is long at 2754.50. The market is currently at 2751. I can get in at a better price. I'm going to synchronize my account and start automation of this strategy. So how would you do that? You're running it in sim mode. This demonstration, I'm running it in playback mode. So you, write, you click on the strategy and you disable the strategy. Connect. Disable the strategy. Now I want to re-enable the strategy. So the trade signal goes away, but you know that it took a signal at 27. Uh, 2754.50 and you're going to change the start behavior to immediately submit and synchronize the account and in my strategies I have this which is very important the stop target based price type is by strategy and so we're not our profit target of 700 and stop loss of 1500 is going to be based on the systematic signal and not it's not based on the actual fill price by default it would be based on the fill price and you can do that but I have it set on buy strategy in my code and so it will use that strategy signal for the profit target and stop loss. So I select enable, immediately s submit and synchronize account, but I want to start the playback first. So it's, it's like it's happening in real time. So I'm going to say OK, I'm not doing it yet. I'm going to start the playback first. So I'm starting market replay again from this point here. Flat, no signals on the screen, but we know the strategy is long at 2754.50. Market replay, I've set it to 1x, so it's not really fast right now. It's, it's normal speed. So press play. And so you're sitting here in real time. You turn off your SIM signal and you go enable to, go to enable a live account. Or you could test it in SIM mode as well. Um, and so you come in here and you select immediately submit, synchronize account. Make sure stop target based prices by strategy. Start behavior. And you select apply. And it's calculating up here at the top, calculating the signal, and you'll see what happens when the signal shows up. Look for Order position. filled. So it is filled. We are filled at 2751.50, and the strategy signal is at 2754.50. And let's look at the let's look at the um, orders. So you have an order here filled at 2751.50. Your profit target is at 2768.50, which is based on the strategy signal. The strategy signal is long at 2754.50, and there's a 14-point profit target, 30-point stop loss. And so you are filled at a better price in this scenario. I'm not recommending that you take all strategies and try to get in at a better price. This video is just for purposes of showing you what to do if you want to synchronize your account with a strategy signal. It's important that your strategy is coded so that the exits are based on the strategy signal and not on the fill, not based on the actual fill. So this is the night trader on April 16th. What would have happened uh, had you done that? And I'm going to speed up market replay so we can finish this trade and you can see um, what it would look like um, where it hits those orders. Order filled. So it hits that, and your uh, your account had $850 profit because you got in three points better. Um, typically, it would be a $700 profit target, but you got in at three points better. So this video, again, shows you how to take a look at a strategy that has a signal but no real-world position. Maybe you're running it in sim mode, and you, and you want to... All of a sudden, get in on that get in on that trade. Maybe you're maybe you have many strategies like we do, and maybe you are waiting for a, the right time to start synchronizing your signals, or maybe you've gone in and exited swing trade strategies over the weekend, and you come back in on Sunday night and you want to synchronize at a better price for those automated trading signals.